offices. Uh, we've seen them headed toward the direction of I-30 now. Uh, they stopped for a short time, but have started marching again. Fox News' Allison Harris has been monitoring these protests. She joins us now with the latest. Allison. Blake, one of these protesters actually just talked to Dallas Police Chief Renee Hall, who said that this has been a peaceful protest so far. As you said, they're now marching toward downtown after being at Dallas Police Headquarters. There were initially hundreds of protesters outside of DPD headquarters, people of all races, all of them protesting the death of George Floyd, who died while in Minneapolis police custody. The crowd was large enough to fill up the plaza in front of the station and the sidewalks around it. The march started within the past hour after 8 o'clock, the time when the Minneapolis curfew was scheduled to go into effect. Police across the country and here in Dallas have condemned the knee restraint that caused Floyd to say, I can't breathe, as he was handcuffed, lying on his stomach, pleading with officers. Speakers at this protest tonight talked about police brutality and deaths of people of color at the hands of police officers. If you try to go to war, you better get some soldiers. Yeah. I'm going to say it again. I said, if we're going to go to war, we better get some soldiers. One speaker tonight said that phones are the only truth that they have right now because people are able to record the interactions black Americans are having with police officers. These protesters have also tried to highlight the deaths of both of Jean and of Tatiana Jefferson, both at the hands of white police officers, both here in the DFW area. For some, it's not their first time chanting things like, no justice, no peace. I know the gun. White comes up. That's not what we're about. We against racist cops, not white cops. You're the reason why they think we hate white people. That's not the, I apologize, that's not our message, sir. White cops don't suck. Racist cops suck, okay? Dallas State Senator Royce West was also there tonight asking everyone to follow NFL star Colin Kaepernick and take a knee. People at DPD tonight were also protesting the deaths of Breonna Taylor and Ahmaud Arbery. Punishing 